Last game, we Please. had um, a dead ogre occurred. You can do this. That lost its heart after Charles climbed back inside and Ooh. cut the heart out. And you discovered that it is a prized possession in parts of the north. Um, in fact, it's an aphrodisiac in some parts of the north. Oh, really? Um, How vulgar. I know. Um, you, Alanthea, are currently on the first floor. Okay, so what would you like to do, guys? Uh, you have a, a, an elf wizard on the first okay. floor and you have a bunch of people in the basement. What's the plan, Stans? Send the people in the basement, leave the basement now that the yoga's dead, uh, and we've tossed the place for anything useful. Yes, you can. That would be okay. nice. Well, I would like to leave the basement. What I'm is the plan for upstairs? You're tossing it upstairs. Well, yeah, you're upstairs at the moment, yet to see out? what's there. But well, it you sounds get as if you, out. you may be getting well, we'll into it. Nice so I've pre-drawn this one. <laughs> this was pre-drawn last week on the off chance that these guys might go upstairs. So, is that the plan, guys? Everybody going upstairs? Yeah. 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 Jolly good. Is, is it, are the curtains still on fire before I go upstairs? No, they've extinguished themselves or burnt themselves up into ash and... You're okay, the, the rest of the building is not on fire. Okay, well, I shall put out a map of the first floor then, as soon as I find it. Okie dokie, guys. So, Alanthea, as you charge on upstairs, you can see straight ahead of you a pair of double doors. Okay. Standing to the right of those double doors, there is a guy in robes holding a mace. Um, you can also see that along this side of the wall, there are three windows. Okay. One is you're in each corner. And you can make out a balustrade here, and a table and a couple of chairs here. There's also a door. To the left of the stairs as you walk up, there's a statue, uh, which looks to you um, like a sort of finely clothed um, elf. Um, then oh. there's a sort of banner curtain in the fireplace. And that's about as much as you can see at the moment. Okay. I would like you to befriend the guy by the door. Okay, so to do that, you will need to make a knowledge check minus his intelligence. Yes. It's all over now. This They'll all be dead. dead. Uh, three. They'll be dead. They'll be dead. So minus three, please. And then you just lampion. open it, stick it straight in the washing machine on a really uh, hot one. Don't stick it on a hot on one, you're ruining it. Hang on. And then. I'm okay, looking so for right. my. It's knowledge, isn't it? Like for me? Yep. Yeah. I know. Right, okay. Let's, let's do this because it's going to be cool if it works. It didn't work. Okay, so um, can I try doing it without befriending him? If you see what I mean, so I mean, so literally just go up there and go, get down there, there's a fight down there. Uh, you can do, um, to which he replies, Well, it seems to have gone very quiet there. And who are you and what are you doing in the Ramont's mansion? Would this be a good time for the rest of us to come clattering up the stairs? Come on, mate. Well come on. <laughs> um, that was your magic phase, Alanthea. Okay. Would you like to do anything else before we yes. in the gang charge on up the stairs? I would like to. Uh, I would actually quite like for a change to stab him with a two handed sword. Okay. So you're going to make your way over. Yep. for it. So, fighting check, please. Minus. His dexterity. <laughs> is... Sorry, you've got to see. Oh, you probably can't see it because of the way it's done. The dog has got his head looking at my pizza. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I can't know if you can see that, but can you see yeah. his face? Yeah. You can see a wolf there briefly. He, sit, he sits with his chin on the top of... When he wants to get up, he does that. He goes... Oh. And he's just doing that. <laughs> And he's, he's slowly working his way around the bed to try and get to the pizza that I'm now going to have to put in the middle of the bed. Right, sorry. So I have to get a fighter check minus... Minus two, please. Minus two. Minus two. Minus, minus two, which is where I have my fighting chick gun and I'm looking. Uh, ooh. Is that strength? Hmm. No, it'd be under fighting, so it'd be under your... One down. Yeah. You've never spelled. You've got agility, right. craft, fighting. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Minus, minus how many? Uh -oh, minus two. Oh, that's a bit sucky. Who does that? Oh, uh, well, I missed him on that as well. So you take a swipe towards his head and he just kind of shimmies out the way. Uh, who's going next? Don't all rush to my aid, it's fine. <laughs> Merce, how are you going next? Well, which staircase are we coming up? Because it's Oh right. my god, my camera just will not. There are two. Oh, why does it hate me? <laughs> <laughs> wow, it just. Uh... Pretty okay. It's, did it freeze, or were you just really still? For it froze. <laughs> okay. So what we should do is we should all stay really still, so that when Mickey comes back, we can uh, <laughs> pretend that our cameras have gone. <laughs> a profile picture on Zoom, so that like I actually oh. have a face and it's broken. However, that means that for all of my lectures, I will also have a profile picture, unless I start signing into my different Zoom accounts every day. But I don't think I want to do. That. I did that, turned up for college one day, and I was basically sat with the mighty bush. Fantastic. I did it at a staff meeting the other day. I had a troll behind me. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> so who's coming up? I don't know. I'll come up. Who's that, Mercer? Preferably me, yep. Preferably okay. the staircase closest to you. Okay. So you're at the top of the up. stairs, Mercer. What would you like to do? Uh, I would like to also attack this guard because if I see a fight, I will just join it. Do you want to go right or left? Uh, left. Left. Okay, should I put you here? Um, okay, so you need to make a fight and check minus two, please. Do I get a plus one because the lamp is then? You do. Sorry, yes. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, fight and check. Ah. Plus one and then minus two. God damn it. Like minus one, yeah. If it wasn't minus mm. anything, it would have been five. But it is, so it's not five. Right, it's okay. Not a good place I to would be like to be at the top of the <laughs> stairs with my bow and arrow, and I would like to shoot Already the guy there. holding the spear. Well, would you like a magic turn first, or are you have yes, to just please. go? Yeah. What would you like to do with your magic turn? I would like to use my fire. Okay, and you're going to target the dude with the mace. Yes. Okay, go for it. So, uh, shooting check minus two, please. Two. You I got, got a two. two. Go yet? I've lost me dice. Oh me. My dice, um, you mean? That, that hits and I'm... causes a wound because it is a firebolt, and you still have your combat turn. How exciting! It is, isn't it? I would like to attempt to finish that dude off. So you need to make a shooting check without a minus this time because the dexterity has been reduced to zero. On account of being on fire. Seventeen, mm. not not going excellently, but you know. Uh, that misses. So that narrowly avoids um, Nurse's nose and thunks into the wall behind her. Um, Sorry, it bro. Is... I was distracted trying to catch my dude funny in my mouth. Either. Hagen <laughs> or Ezra's going. Who would like to go next? Ezra next. Ezra next. Okay, so I'll put you at the top of the stairs, Ezra. Where do you want to go from there? You should. Uh, I'm close enough to hit him, I think, because I've got eight spaces of movement. Yeah, do you want to go to the right of Valanthia or to the left? 
uh, to the right, and to I'm going right. to try and hit them with my mace. Okie dokie. So you need to make a fighting check minus one. Because you've got five. loads of people attacking him at the same time. He's on fire. Wait. No, so seven there. I get an advantage, so I put one higher than what's on my sheet, right? Whatever's on your sheet, anytime it says plus or minus, it's taking it or adding it to the number on the sheet. Oh, actually, yeah, it would be, yeah, it's you just get a plus one, actually, because they have no dexterity, so, yeah, it's fighting plus one. And is he wounded? Does that make a difference or not? Uh, that's already affected his dexterity. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, cool, I'm under set. Oh, sick! I got a... <clears throat> oh, oh, sick, I got a four. <laughs> <laughs> and what's your fighting with the plus one? A uh, seven. Seven. So you've made three points of damage. Uh, his armor stops one point, so that's two points of damage. And let's mm. see, I think his toughness is. Well, he's got to get three minus two. Points. So he's got to get a one to save. And he gets a nine, so. What happens? Ezra, tell us what happens. Oh, oh sick. I hit him with my mace, didn't I? Um, you have a choice here. You could knock him out or you could kill him. Your choice would explain either way. Oh, um, I'm just gonna uh, put my arm around with the mace and hit him in the side of the head. Um, questionable coma, I think, is what I'm aiming for. So he could still be, uh, he could still be alive, but he's definitely <laughs> down. Yeah, but coma. like... Is that a, a medical definition? <laughs> well, he's it's a coma, a... but it's a questionable coma. <laughs> he's in <laughs> an <laughs> induced coma, induced by a large mace. <laughs> hey, okay. would you like to take your turn? Hey, what would you like I really to do? would. While they're all busy doing the fighting, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be, you know, I, I'm, I'm a stealer, not a fighter. I'm going to be sidling around the room looking for like any like secret cubby holes and things okay so i can put While you up here so in terms of looking for cubby holes and things um all you can really see are the windows down this side okay. you can see a brazier here and here you see a okay. double door here yes. curtain a fireplace yes. another curtain another double door another brazier you can make out this statue of the elf in fire. I haven't clothing. even taken my eyes off that. I haven't even blinked last. Oh, okay. And you can also make out another statue further down the hall, which looks a little bit shorter. And you can also see that there are two doors either side of a curtain here and a ladder leading up to a trap door in the ceiling. I'm obviously going for the ladder. Okie dokie. So, oh, how far do you move? We need more right. trap doors. That's definitely what we I'm need. I'm going to open that trap door because there's something up there. Don't go into that trap door. Okay, so you're making your way over to the trap door. How far do you move, Hagen? Nine. Okay. Lars and I used to watch that when we got drunk, didn't we? Oh, it's so good. I love trap door. So, you can definitely get to the foot of the stairs, and actually I'll say you'll get to just underneath the trapdoor, but I'm going to ask you to make a perception check. Oh no, not a perception check! Oh yes, a perception check. I'm not at what all are perceptive. you, four? <laughs> <laughs> Funny what you should say you that. Four? Of all of the things, I never get to make a stealth check or an agility check, and I'm not making an agility check, and fly up the ladder really quickly and open the trap door. Well, I'm not... a priest and I have a mace. You're can... really agile. You can if you wish. Um, but yes. I'm going to ask you to make... Yeah, I mean, that will determine how far oh, you can climb the ladder. Yeah. And we can all be impressed by your stealth and speed. You, uh, but I'm still going to ask you to make a perception check to see if you okay. hear anything. Come I got side. eight on my agility, so I'm extremely agile and I'm up the, up the ladder. You um, need to be, do the perception check so you know if there's anything up there before you go and then get killed. Which so as you, you make no, your way quickly up the ladder, <laughs> uh, Charles looks at Alanthia and goes, that was quick, wasn't it? Just, uh, <gasps> Alanthia goes, yeah, it's like a squirrel. It's a squirrel! <laughs> Look what I did get! Me and Megan went... <laughs> Look what I did get! A one? What did you get? You got a one? I never get a one! For your perception. Yeah. Okay. 
So as you are, as, as you are about to open the trap door, <gasps> you make out the noise of many feet uh, and a clicking sound. That's a kind of insecty type pincers. Oh no! Ooh, got... That doesn't sound good, does it? Um, would you still like to open the trap door? Not so much. No, I'm not going to lie to you. Okay, so you are at the top of the ladder. They're really huge fleas. Uh, Amaril is going to come up the stairs and she is going to... Where is she going to go? She is going to come and stand next to Alanthia. Hey! And she's going to say, impressive. Uh, and at that, around the corner, it's going to come rushing this guard, who moves? Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And they're going to come to the bottom of the ladder, the foot of the ladder, and they are going to take a swipe at you, Hagen. What's your dexterity, please? I'm outraged. Mm -hmm. Um. I believe I'm, I'm, I've got full dexterity. Do I have anything extra for anything that I have, for like height and being really agile and, I don't know, holding a crossbow, anything, literally. Oh, trying to manipulate your own. Taken <laughs> into account with your dexterity. So the guard needs to get a five or less to hit you. And with their first swing, they miss, but they get a second swing. And with their second swing, they miss. Eight. The other one is going to throw a spear at your back, Mercer. Um, <laughs> it is indeed. Three. three. So they need to get a three or less. Okay, and they miss. So they're two spears. Um, both of these guards are carrying, well one, this one's carrying a sword and this one's carrying an axe. They both have light armor and shields. Um, so two. Um, this door is going to open and as it does, Mercer, you look inside a bedroom. Directly in front of you, there is a window. There's a double bed. And you can just make out a little table either side of the bed and two chests at the end of the bed. There's a couple of chairs either side and a double door here. Uh, and as the door opens, you see a woman with dark hair um, she has wow, wow, wow. fine uh, black robes and she Maybe looks at you, Mercer, and mm -hmm. takes three steps back. Jumps out the window. I'm and going to be drawing a weapon. she launches a fireball at you. Am I allowed to try and dodge? <laughs> yeah, your dexterity will make you try and dodge. What was your dex, please? Three. Three, so she needs to get... She needs to get a four or less, and she gets a five. So her fireball narrowly misses and flies off across uh, and impacts on the wall at this end of the corridor. And it is Alanthia's go. Ooh. I think I am going to say, um, I'm going to say, get back. And, and protect, put an arm back uh, out to sort of protect um, uh, kick ass. You are a little bit. <laughs> and, um, and I am going to return fire with, I think I'm going to return fire with another fireball, to be honest. Who are you aiming at? Uh, at the lady in, lady in black. Lady in black. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay, Lars. Yep. Lars, when you say fine robes, do you mean posh robes or thin robes? 
maybe <laughs> both. Uh, no, it's uh, posh hoops. They're practical, um, you know, they'll keep you warm in a blizzard. And um, what's my minus? Oh, sorry. Uh, so her depth is three. So you've got a minus three from your shooting. I hit her. Okie dokie. Uh, so her fine robes are engulfed in flame and she is wounded. And on fire. Yeah, and briefly on fire. Drop and roll. Drop and roll. <laughs> Out the window. Um, is what's what is actually behind her? The window. <laughs> I am going enough. to. I want to take a flying run at her and put both feet into the middle of her chest and try and knock her out the window. Okay. Do uh, it. How far do you move? Have my rope. Have my oh, rope and swing from the chandeliers. I move. Uh, ding, 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 ding. I've lost it now. Where is it? Uh, I'm going to do that. I'm uh, going to eight. Swing from the chandeliers. Eight. So you can definitely do that. One, two, three, four. Uh, make a fighting check, please. And you will have minus nothing on this fighting check. Oh, okay. Right, well, let's do that then. Hang on. Tom, oh. has it occurred to you that if she goes through the window, you may follow? Oh, but not with both feet. You see, I reckon I could do like the like the wrestlers do, where they run up and they do that thing where they double, they get both feet and thump like them up the person. The... And, yeah, like a drop, so they go up and they like hit her with both their feet, and then hit, they hit the floor and they go out the window. Hopefully, like and a I, drop kick. And I passed it, indeed. Okay. I got a five. Uh, so let's see. You got a five, so that will be. Um... So she gets no protection, so that's five points of damage. Oh, hang on, you got a five, and what's your fighting? Seven. Seven, so two points of damage. Right, her toughness is down to three, so she needs to get a one to save. <laughs> oh dear. And she gets a 20, so hey! as your feet connect with her chest, you just see this fiery bulk crash through the window and disappears from sight with smoke trailing. Get uh, in. And she is indeed knocked out on the floor below outside. On fire. Yeah, on fire. Smouldering. <laughs> we nice. dealt with her pretty quickly. Um, <laughs> and it is Mercy's go. I, I think Elanthi might be a little overprotective. <laughs> of her elf breath, uh, sister. Hmm. It would appear so. I'm, like, I'm still stood in the doorway, right? Is that, well, yeah, basically. Yeah, you're, you're stood here okay. with a downed bloke in robes and a mace here. You've just kind of watched this woman get kicked out the window. There's a couple of guards. One of them is threatening a hobbit up, so, up a ladder. Uh, and there's another one who's just thrown a spear at your back. Hmm. I'll go for the one by Hagen. Thanks. Okay. One, two, three. Yeah, you can definitely get into combat. And you'll get a plus one on your combat because Hagen's yeah. there as well. Oh, uh, so you need to make a fighting check, plus one, and then yep. minus two. Okay. Oh, uh, I got five. You need seven five. or less. You need a seven or less. Uh, so that's two points of damage. Um, but unfortunately for you, uh, the sword and light armor stop the damage. Did you add one to your fighting? Yep. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so that stops that. Um, and it is Charles, you'll get. Right. Hello. Mm -hmm. Come and do the one by me. Do the one by oh. me. Yeah, all one. right. Thanks. We I'd have like to get to hand, hand for that for you. Oh, mercy. Physically... As you get there and you take your swing at the guard, wait. you notice that the statue behind her. Wait, wait, wait. Looks I a bit like. I damage, don't I? 
Mm -hmm. Is it moving? I get plus one on damage, don't I? So I actually would have done three points. Oh yes, you do. So you've Ooh. done one point. So they need to get they need to get five or less. You're quite right. Well remembered. And they fail. So you have yeah. wounded. <laughs> Lars, did you say the statue was moving? It's not moving, but it does look a bit like Throderick. Okay. Ooh, that's odd. It does sound a bit weird. Our that's dwarf odd. friend. Your dwarf friend, yeah. Hmm. As long as it's not moving, we're all right. Nah, not moving. It is In the sense that, like, it is Throderick, just trying Attention. real hard to make no. us think he's a statue? No, no just, just actually... from a, a racial it's... sense in that it, it looks like a dwarf. That it bears resemblance. Oh, yeah. it's a dwarf. Uh, it's it's just the... Okay, so it's not, it is thought Frodrick. It's not like, that looks just like Frodrick. That's more of a, hey, when you've seen one dwarf, you've seen them all. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> so, so I think that fact, looks like You're Frodrick. being racist. Pretty uh, much. <laughs> is that what yeah. you were trying to say, though? I'm, right? I'm inadvertently okay. being racist. Yes, you're correct. <laughs> Uh, okay, sorry, um, Charles, what would you like to do? You have a wounded would... guard here and a guard who is not wounded over here. I would like to go and attempt to just like rugby tackle the not wounded guard to the floor, please. How far do you move? Six. Okay. Six. Yeah, you can just get there. Uh, you'll need to make a fighting check minus what? Minus two. I get the sense that I'm just going to bounce off him. Possibly. That's fine, though. <laughs> I got a one! Oh, my word. Okay. Mm. So, you're fighting as well? Seven. 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 So, that is six points of damage, minus two for the armor and shield. So, that's four points of damage. They have a toughness of six, so they've got to get two or less. And they get an eight, so you have wounded. And successfully rugby tackled guard to the floor. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, uh, Ezra, it is your game. Yo, what's up? It's your boy Ezra here. Ah. <laughs> right. Uh, smack him with my mace. How far do you move? Eight spaces. Who are you smacking? Um. Do you I can get the... in to combat yeah. with this one, the one at the base of the ladder. Yes. You'll get a plus one to your combat, and it'll be minus nothing because they are wounded. Uh, I... no. <laughs> I've got a 16, I needed a 6. Okay, so you miss, uh, and it is Hagen's go. Oh, goody. Okay, so I want to, like, do a swing around the ladder, Mm -hmm. and then kick the one near me in You the can chops. use me as a bouncing pad if you need. Okay. Oh, excellent. Kick so the you... one near me in the chops with my hairy hobbit feet, which is going to gross them out so much because they're going to have loads of hair in their mouth that I think <laughs> I should be able to get an extra point. <laughs> <laughs> so nicely, uh, nicely um, <laughs> argued. Do you know what? I am going to give you a plus one because you're at a higher level than them. So you no, get my hairy hobbit feet. And your hairy hobbit feet. <laughs> it would have only been a plus half if it hadn't have been for the hairy hobbit feet. Um, <laughs> and you will get plus one to your fighting. Oh, yeah. that's like, that, well, you know. Yeah. That's going to give me like an extra 25%. Um, <laughs> <laughs> my fighting is bad. Well, it's one better than it would have been. It is. It's fighting is bad. It's bad. It's bad. Oh, gosh. Where is it? And I failed miserably with a two and a zero. So as you go to swing round and hit the guard, uh, your foot gets entwined or entangled within the ladder and you are now suspended upside down from the ladder. I'm a terrible, terrible thief. And to <laughs> top it all, your rations have just tumbled all over the floor. Oh no! Oh, That's the end. Uh, and with that, Amaril will take 
a few steps forward. Uh, and she is going to. Let's find Amarillo. Where are you, Amarillo? Could be here somewhere. Uh, keep going. Here she is. So Amarillo moves. to here um, and she is going to launch a firebolt at the wounded one here so she's going to get um, they have no dexterity so she's just going to make a shooting check that's eight or less but she gets three so that's five points of damage uh, the minus two for the armor and the shield so that's three points of damage Toughness of the fighter is reduced to three. Um, yeah, so they've got to get three or less. And they get a 16. So this one is downed. With her combat turn, she's going to target this wounded one here. And she needs to get a shooting check. Uh, minus nothing, so she's got to get eight or less. And she gets a 20. So the arrow flies past and impacts on the wall over here. Actually, shatters the window and disappears into the night. Um, so, it is this guard's turn. They are going to take a swing at you, Charles. And you have... I don't deserve this. Please, no one step on my food while you're running about trying to kill people. Possibly... <laughs> um... My rations! <laughs> Rampled raisins between our toes. <laughs> oh, that's so gross. Watch your feet. You know, there's, there's some nuts there. You might end up sliding. Um, okay, so they're going to make a fighter check, that. which will be six or less. Oh, what's your dexterity, actually, Charles? Three. Okay, so they've got to get three or less. Fails the first one, has another swing. Fails the second one, and Alanthia, it's your go. Uh, I am going to get up because obviously I am on the floor mm -hmm. after my amazing, amazing kick. And um, um, and I will. You said there's a couple of chests. There are Actually, first of, before I do that, I'm going to look out the window, which I assume isn't really in action as such. And, well, you're um, pretty much there, so I'll allow that. Yeah. Uh, and what's she doing on the floor? Is she out cold, is she? She's out cold and smouldering. Okay. Um, I, I, I'm going to search the chests, hoping that this okay. is her room. So you're right next to this chest. I'll let you search this chest. Okay. And within that chest, you find... A key. A key. A key. A, a big key or a little key? Uh, you know, a, a key about this long. Okay, so like, a, yeah, like a, it could be a bit a main door key, not like a yeah. uh, a writing desk key. It's, yeah, it's, it's like a door key, not a, yeah, not a kind of. Um, Does it match the other key that key. I had or not? This one appears different. Okay. That's cool. uh, okay. Yeah. Um. So, Mercer, it is your go. Yeah. What would you like to do? Well, now I hmm, want to go for the one that tried to throw the spear at me, if I can. You can move to here. You'll get plus one on your fighting. Um, yeah, so fighting check plus one. Never mind. <laughs> and Charles, your go. Do we have an uninjured guard? No, the only guard left standing is the one right in front of you, and that one's wounded. Okay. Oh yeah, I do see the little counter now. Um, I would, well, if I'm already on top of him, I would jump him, please. Okay, uh, so make a fighting check. 
plus one. I can't find my mouse cursor. Seventeen. Bad news, lads. <laughs> fail. Bad uh, news. Ezra, it is your go. Hi. Oh, I'll take another swing. So you're going to move into contact with this one. So you'll get a oh, fighting yeah. check plus one. Oh, I don't pass it. Okay, that's a fail. Hagen, you'll go. Okay. Can my hands reach the floor? Uh, it would be really useful if they could. Okay, yes, they can. Excellent. So I am going to untangle my feet yeah. and I am going to put my hands on the floor and with my massive agility, I am going to spring upright and wrap my legs around the person's neck next to me, <laughs> fling myself round and break their neck in the manner of all good female assassins everywhere. Well, seeing as that person's already knocked out, I will allow that. Um, yes! So this one is now actually dead. Uh, yeah. I love it. What Job do done. I have to do? Agility, agility. They're already knocked out. Can I do agility? I think seeing as they're unconscious on the floor, you could probably wrap your legs around them and do that anyway. Uh, Excellent. I'm going to do that. Yeah, Snap. so you have a, a, a dead guard here. Um, and it's Amarille's go. So Amarille is going to target the wounded guard here. Uh, she's going to need to get a shooting check minus now. Um, her shooting is 